hola, marhaba, namaste, buongiorno, and more. What's up guys, welcome to another Mark Hashim video. So as you know, the art of hand gestures is an art that is practiced all around the world. I'm doing it right now. And sometimes similar hand gestures are seen in different countries, but the meanings aren't always the same. So what happens when you throw them at each other? Here we go. To begin, we tackle the purse finger technique, a common gesture in Lebanon and several parts of the Middle East. The Rushway or Halla Farjik is often used as an invitation to calm down, sprinkled with an air of subtle threat, comparable with the Italian Makedici or Kivoi. For the Lebanese variation, the eyes are locked on the subject with a defying and slightly outraged look. For the Italian variation, you may place the forearm parallel with the torso and begin your questions while motioning up and down. Go ahead. Gracias, amigo. Don't backhand me. What the hell? Este, bueno, de nada, pero, pero gracias. You get out of here. No, no, gracias a ti, wey. Gracias a ti. We follow with the Mexican gracias hand sign. In many parts of the world, the hand is usually raised with palms forward to thank the other, but in Mexico, the palm is reversed, which to the unfamiliar eye might appear as the backhand threat. As such, ensure that the forearm remains vertical and avoid any chambering motion with the backhand, which suggests preparation to launch a neck-breaking attack upon the face. Unless, of course, you are in fact seeking to threaten an opponent or educate your child. I'm joking. That's a horrible way to raise your child. You sick, heartless monster. All them is Filios. Huh? Wow. Really, man? The lovely family you have. Uh, wonderful. In the great majority of the world, the OK sign signifies approval, delight, and all kinds of positive feelings. But not in Brazil, where it is instead used as the equivalent of the FU sign. As such, if you seek to give approval, do place your index and thumb together in a circle with the other fingers up, but not too Brazilian, unless you are consciously trying to insult them. If you seek to prank someone, instruct them to perform the technique too Brazilian, and tell them to maintain a wide, innocent smile to make sure they get their ignorant teeth broken. Hey, long time no see, man. Tikanis, I'm, I'm, I'm just giving you a high five. Nah. Indeed. The high five is, in many countries, an invitation to clap hands with a friend, for encouragement and or greeting. But in Greece, this sign is often used as an insult, the mutsa, mimicking the action of wiping cinder or crap on a person's face. So the next time you wave or try to high five someone, remember you're also inviting them to receive a smudge of crap on their face. So is Diego coming or not? No way, no puede. Okay, fine. I guess uh, that leaves you and me then. It's good. What are you doing? What, you want my perfume or something? What are you, scratching the air? Many countries are familiar with the use of a finger to answer no, by wagging the finger like a windshield wiper. But perhaps few are aware of the Mexican yes finger bending. Indeed, to perform a finger yes, simply raise the index and bend it forward repeatedly. Use especially to assist a nod, or when the mouth is unavailable to assist you in providing a clear answer, like when you're drinking. There are no specific gestures to discuss at the moment for the Japanese. Simply be aware that hand gestures in general are restricted in Japan. As it may appear rude and aggressive, do pay particular attention to and limit any habitual wide movements you perform during conversation with the Japanese which for countries like Lebanon, Italy, Greece, will be practically impossible. The rotating hand gesture is popular in Lebanon, used mostly to assist a question, very much like the Indian variation, though with the latter, Indians can be seen adding extra arm motion towards the body in a circular manner, occasionally to mean, I don't know. Whereas with the Lebanese variation, the arm will be extended forward in a more challenging way. Note, did I just detect a hint of Lebanon-India bromance? Interesting. 
All right, thanks for watching another Mark Cashman video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you like comedy and culture, this is your channel. And of course, thank you, merci, obrigado, gracias, grazie, daniwad, shukran, and we'll see you later. <laughs> Take care. Mm-hmm.